edition of this month's experiment from the Reuben H. Fleet Science Center in San Diego, California. I'm Nicole Schiffer. I'm Brandon Elliott, and this is our friend Chelsea here. She's going to help us out today. Today we're going to be doing a really cool science experiment. I'm going to give you uh, some of the ingredients that are going to be, we're going to be using for this. Um, but just remember, you can find all of our ingredients and directions on our website, www.rhfleet.org. All right, so you're going to be needing for this <clears throat> three yogurt cups like this, uh, some water right here, uh, a stick, uh, two clear tall cup, cups like this, and about a half cup measuring cup right there. I think it's a quarter of a cup. A quarter of a cup measuring cup. <laughs> Great. Thank you, Brandon. Before we get started, guys, I'm going to show you this really cool science trick I learned. All right. All right so I have three cups. Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> so I have three yogurt cups, and I'm going to put water in one of them. I need you guys to close your eyes. Cover them up. Hi. You two audience, close and cover your eyes. And I'm going to pour a fourth a cup of water into oops, this cup. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and shuffle them. You guys can keep your eyes closed. Shuffling, shuffling. All right. You can open them now. All right, so I put water in one of these cups, and I need you guys to choose which cup you want me to pour over your head. Great. Pour right. over our head? Over like this, yes. Wonderful. I didn't know I was getting wet today. Yes, well, surprise! <laughs> okay. Neither did I, so there you go. <laughs> cool. So which one do you choose, Brandon? Uh, I, I'm going to pick the one closest to me, because you wouldn't pour water on my head. Oh, of course not. No. Never. Right. Can I do the honors, though? Okay. All right. All right. Oh, you got lucky. Oh. All right, Chelsea, what do you think? Which one do you choose? <sighs> okay, how about the one closest to me? Okay. Jeez. Why not? I guess I'll do the honors. Yeah. Go I'm for sorry. It. Babe. Nice. Okay, good deal. Cool. Oh, no. Well. Uh, wait, wait. You please. I insist. <laughs> yeah. I insist. Yeah. Absolutely. All right. Well, do you want to do it together? Yeah. Okay. okay. All okay. Right, here we go. One, one, two, two three. three. Wait, oh. what? How much that going on? <laughs> Surprise! Okay, so. <laughs> please explain. Surprise. Um, so you poured awesome water in one of them. Though, I did right? pour mm -hmm. water in this one, actually. I and what it. I didn't tell you was I had... Oh, here we go. Whoa. <laughs> what is that? Sodium polyacrylate. It is in diapers. Whoa. It is very <laughs> absorbent. And that's what I put in here. So when I put the water in, it actually absorbed the water. Okay. So it's a polymer. It's thirsty. It's great. <laughs> Tricked exactly. you guys. Yep. Tricked you guys, too? Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> There you go. Yeah, All I couldn't right. have explained it better. Actually, yeah, this is a, this is actually a polymer that's gonna soak up water. It's a, it's what they call a hydrophilic polymer. And remember that a polymer is a long branch chain of molecules yeah. strung together, like we did with our slime. Exactly, same mm -hmm. thing. So you've got another one here. That's really cool. You, I couldn't even really see anything in there. Great. So let's test the absorbency of diapers, which is what polyacrylate is in. It is actually filled with diapers are actually filled with this. Sodium polyacrylate so to, make it to make it absorbent. Uh -huh. And we're going to test it versus your common cotton ball. So that's why we have the clear mason jars. Didn't tell you that one either. And we're going to put about the same amount of cotton balls as the sodium polyacrylate. So all we did was open up the diaper, <laughs> the clean, clean diaper, <laughs> and take out <laughs> stuff in the middle. All right, I'm going to try to get enough in there to try to Make it equal. That's why you guys have the popsicle sticks. And all right, so let's test it with a fourth cup of water. All right, I'll Is go ahead and pour it into the cotton first. Oh man, it's absorbing some, but already you can kind of see that water's starting to collect at the bottom. Great. Right. So that was now, three scoops? Yeah, three scoops there. Three scoops here. Oh, Ooh, nice. nice. I get to do the honors. Thanks. Yeah, have Chelsea do this. Great. Let's see my water pouring <laughs> skills, shall we? <coughs> Oops, see? Told you. <laughs> it's all good. <coughs> and three. Nice. So as you can probably tell, <coughs> the sodium polyacrylate is already absorbing yeah. So if I pour this out, we actually get a little bit of water. I could pour up more, but this we don't. Wow. So it works. Nice. That is why diapers work. Great. Excellent. Well, thank you. I learned something new today. You're welcome. Thanks for being our guest appearance, Chelsea. My pleasure. Anytime. Nice. All right. So thank you, viewers, for watching. And remember, 
Do try this at home. Stop, 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 stop